from a bitachin perspective, whatever Hashem wants to happen, in whichever time, it's impossible for us to overcome. And in this week's parasha, we have a similar message. The Pasuk says that the Shvatim see Yosef approaching, and they say, let us kill him and throw him into a pit. And the Pasuk concludes, and we'll see what will happen with his dreams. Rashi comments that it wasn't the Shvatim who were saying, and let's see what will happen with his dreams about becoming king. Because obviously if Yosef will be killed, then his dreams of becoming king will never be fulfilled. So Rashi comments that it was really Hashem who was saying, Hashem was saying, you Shvatim, you think you're going to kill him? I have certain dreams for Yosef, says Hashem. Yosef is supposed to become a king and everyone else is supposed to bow to him. And if that's what I want, that's what's going to happen. You could think that you're going to kill him. But what I want is ultimately going to be fulfilled. And this is a general bitachin lesson in everything in life. It's important to be in sync and aligned with what Hashem wants. And never to try to force other things to happen. Because whatever Hashem wants will ultimately be fulfilled and will ultimately be carried out.